what had happened on a busy D.C. street. We're talking about an armed robbery this morning with bullets flying. The robbery took place in the 5,000 block of New Hampshire Avenue Northwest. Amy Sudowitz joins us live. Amy? Well, witnesses say it all happened very fast. An armored truck was making a stop at the shopping center when an innocent bystander got shot. A liquor store manager was shot in the foot during an attempted armored car robbery. Yeah, he was just at the wrong place at the wrong time. Police say at around 9 o'clock this morning, a Brinks armored truck with two people inside pulled in front of the Wachovia Bank on the 5,000 block of New Hampshire Avenue Northwest. Someone opened fire on the truck. At the same time, workers were preparing to open the fair liquor store for business. We were outside and uh, we were putting salt on the floor. That's all what we saw. That time was gunshot and then he got shot right under the feet, under his feet. Police closed off the area around the shopping center as they searched for suspects. The liquor store manager who was shot in the foot was taken to Howard Hospital. His uncle says he's expected to recover. I just saw him from the hospital and he, he looked okay. This, he just had a band-aid on his heel. Meanwhile, the bank was temporarily closed as police looked for evidence. The fact that somebody may be timing the deliveries of the Brinks trucks to the bank or to other people coming to the bank. Uh, we um, are working with the bank and the, uh, the owners of the shopping plaza to make sure that everybody's safe just goes into the bank and to the other stores in the shopping plaza. And one of the Brinks employees was actually grazed in the foot by a bullet, but he was not hurt. Police say that no money was stolen during this incident, but this is not the first time something like this has happened here. Back in March, an armored truck was robbed and two bags of money were stolen. Police are looking into the possibility that these cases are linked tonight. The search for suspects continues. Reporting live in Northwest, Amy Sudowitz, 9 News. Okay, Amy, thanks a lot. Tonight